it was going viral online when Matthew Stafford's wife came out. Basically, said that she used to date his backup quarterback in college. She, she did it to make him jealous. Well, she came out again, I guess, recently, kind of quote unquote ripping all the insecure men for the reaction to her sleeping or dating uh, her husband, Matthew Stafford's college backup QB. And she had a caption in her post saying, uh, realizing how many insecure men there are out there. So grateful I married the complete opposite is what she said in her recent social media post. Um, I guess I'll, I'll give my, my take on here. Listen, I mean, are there insecure men out here? Do we do, do men have insecurity? Of course. Of course we do. But at the same time, this conversation to me ain't got nothing to do with the insecure men. It's about there's certain things as a wife and as a husband that you just keep in-house. And especially in this position, I think any position you, you keep it in house. I wouldn't want my girl, and I, I'm not some big star. I wouldn't want my girl going around saying she slept with my backup defensive tackle or, that, or, or, or dated. I know we're assuming they slept together, but dated, whatever. My thing is this why say it? Why? What's the win in you saying that? You know, you're with one of the premier players and quarterbacks in, in the, the NFL. He plays for the LA Rams. He's in Los Angeles, one of the biggest markets, Super Bowl champion. And it's the off season at that, meaning that in the media, it ain't much to talk about right now, Kelly. So for you to bring this up, you had to know that it had the potential to go viral. And my thing is, I think you you did know and you just didn't care because that's what you wanted. You know, you're on a podcast. I don't know if it's your podcast or your friend's podcast or whatever the case may be. You're on it. And we all want if you got a podcast, a digital show, you want those viral moments. But don't do it at the expense of your husband. Now, again, is it that big of a deal? No, you're still married. He's good. But I guarantee Matt came home after, you know, seeing this online, seeing it go, you know, in all the articles and, and tweets and all the trolls. Maybe his teammates joked with him, whatever. I'm sure he came home that night like, like, Kelly, what are we doing? Like, why you put that out there? Like, I'm sure well, he came is she admitting like that, it's the principle. Is she admitting to intercourse? that's what it sounds like. She didn't say, I didn't fuck the guy. I just dated him. She didn't say that. So the original thing was I dated, meaning everyone took it and said, that means fuck. Right. Which, I mean, let's be real. If you're dating somebody, especially in college, but if you're dating somebody, unless you're celibate, not out of 10, you probably are having sex. But she never. But she wasn't. But that's not how I took it, though. I took it as in she was fucking with Matthew Stafford. And then she said she went on the side and was fucking dating, whatever that means. So that means. Were you actually just fucking with Matthew Stafford and and, and I'm gonna go out with him tonight? And 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 I, that I mean, you uh, had to fuck. I didn't read it like that. I I didn't read because right. you, you're I think reading we always it almost read it like, like she like cheated on Matthew. Stafford. I, I read it like her and Stafford was kind of like on some on and off shit, and and but he was kind of playing games. So during this particular time, she was single, but she knew she wanted Stafford. But Stafford was on, you know, he young, ball yeah, here, quarterback, here, here, probably here. fucking around. She said, "I'm gonna make him jealous." So she went here's, with here's my point to that. Jealous. Here's the here's the point to I'm I'm trying to help her out and hope that she that's what she meant. We all know what it meant, but we're go, I'm trying to help her out because she had the opportunity to come out in this post and say I was just fucking around and and fucking with the backup, but I never had sex with him. Mm. She could have cleared the airway. She did not. That was my whole point in asking that question and how you took it compared to how I took it. She had the opportunity, at least, to say, I didn't really embarrass my my family. I was just talking, and I, I didn't fuck them. You know what I mean? Like, right, she had right. the opportunity, homie. She even looks worse now to me because you had the opportunity. 